All right, first of all, I want to thank everybody on behalf of Sheriff Ramsey. I don't know if a lot of people know, but his father passed away, so he can't be here today. So um, we're all going to do a little bit of a cleanup right here in this area for Sea Oats Beach, okay? It's going to run all the way down here to the gas station, which is um, the old Crazy Billy's, all the way up to where the, the, um, the brush is up here. What I want to do is kind of split the teams up here so half of us will be on this side or maybe a quarter on this side and the rest of everybody will be on the, uh, the northbound side of the road over here. We've got grabbers, there's bags. Public Works should be coming along to pick up the trash so just set your bags off to the side of the road and they'll get it. And then um, I got uh, Sergeant Johnson and a couple of his guys, Tony and Marty, they'll have the, the pickup truck and stuff with the lights going to keep everybody safe off of the road and that. So just stay off of the highway, but down into the, the sandy area of the, the beach here, and then just up along this area here, okay? Anybody have any questions or you guys need anything? We have water and stuff in the truck, and we'll run that back and forth to you guys also. Um, but anyway, I really appreciate everybody being here. This is another great group. You guys have always done so well, and this is a great area to clean up. It's so what I want to do is get everybody in front of the car for me. I want to get a group picture of everyone, all right? So everybody kind of okay. gather around the patrol car. Let's go. Come on, come on, come on. Huh? Come on, come on. <laughs> <laughs> Hey Paul, what's going on? Not much, man. We're out doing our cleanup here today. Yeah. Yeah, man. So, so you can't, I'm glad you came out for it. Hey, it's an early one, huh? Yeah, it's early, but uh, plenty of support out here today. I tell you, a lot of people got up and got out for it, so I'm glad you did. Uh, Paul is one of our sponsors for helping.org and uh, uh, owns Key Lime Sailing Club and Cottages. Yeah. And I'm glad when I see our people come out, man. Yeah. Even the one you sponsored last week, man, you got in there with everybody. Yeah, right. I love it, Paul. Well, have a good day, man. Right, I'll we'll talk to you, you later, okay, guys? Hey girls, how's everybody doing? Hi. Isabella? Hi. Hey, this is Isabella from HuffandDollar.org. You having fun today? Yeah. Crazy glasses <laughs> today. Yeah. Extra crazy. And you have some team members here. Hey Kendall, how you doing? Hi. Thanks for coming out. Hi. Kendall's mom. Hi. Hey. How are you? Good, good. Thanks for everybody being part of it. Hey Lizbeth. Hey Rick, good morning. Good morning. Hey Kaylee, how are you doing? Good. I can't, I can't talk to Kaylee only for a moment because she was so sleepy I could barely talk to her earlier. Yeah. This is 8.30 a.m. cleanup. How you doing? Hi. Hey Louisa, how, how are you? I'm doing good. Good, good. And this sir, one of those, is Isabella's grandmother. She doesn't speak English, but she comes out to every cleanup and cleans just like everybody else. That's what it's all about. Get out ahead, everybody, so you can kind of see what everybody's cleaning up here. Very unhappy person who lost their key. Oh my goodness! Right? When, we, when we say you'll never know what you find. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy! Oh my goodness! No telling how long that's been sad here. Made for a very sad day. Yes, especially if they watched this video and they were like, we were looking right in that area. <laughs> who are you with? What's your name? Uh, I'm Sharon. I live over in White Marlin Beach. Okay, you're just coming out to help out. Yeah. Well, I'm with helping.litter.org and seemybeach.com, oh, and we're glad okay. to see you out here, so Very thanks for nice. coming. That's a killer. That's going to take an expert to get that out. Yeah, I saw it. Not going to happen. It's under the rock. It's gonna stay there. Yeah, I'm gonna take all that sand. Wait, right here. Look! Oh, he's got a knife. Kendall, he's got a knife, baby. I know, the end of it's right here, but it's coming to sand. Are you?
right, y'all hold on one second. Oh yeah, turtle trap. Have any bags on here? No bags. Unfortunately. Can you make a loop and get some? Because we need more bags out here. Or have somebody or tell them to come back here. Okay. What's yeah. your name? I'm delivering water right now. Awesome. What's your name? Marty. Nice to meet you, Marty. Well, I'm Rick with See My Beach and HelpInDollar.org. Okay. Appreciate what you guys are doing. That sheriff's department is always wonderful for supporting everybody. All right. So, but if you can have somebody run by here with some bags, yep. this is this is unbelievable out here with the trash embedded down in the ground and everything. So we're getting more than we even thought we would. Yeah. Nice meeting you, okay? There's some water in the back if you need it. Appreciate it. You need water? Okay. No, I, I just need love. Okay. All right, buddy. Thank you so much. I'm good right now. Have a good day. Yay. All right. Corey's delivering the bags. Corey to the rescue. How you doing, sir? I'm good, Rick. Excellent. You always find Corey at these kind of things. Mrs. Caputo, how are you doing? I'm good, thank you. Excellent. Part of our team here with HelpinDollar.org. Did you guys get to sign in? No. Can I get you to yep, see that? Yep, absolutely. Please, Thanks for what you guys do, Corey, okay? Uh, no, Take no, care, buddy. Thanks. I'm out here right now with Ray. How you doing, Ray? I'm good. How you doing? Good, good. From the Sheriff's Department. You guys are amazing. I'll tell you what. You, when you come out here, you organize these things. You're also out here cleaning. Yes, sir. Thank I think you, that's sir. a fantastic thing. Yeah, the, without, uh, without this kind of organization, uh, of course, the, uh, the beach would be overrun. Right. And we're also worried about the sea turtles at the same time. Absolutely. And y'all catch some of the areas that are like kind of ignored because it's kind of in the middle of nowhere. Yes, sir. Yeah. yeah. And uh, next time, the only complaint we have is a schedule it later in the day. <laughs> well, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm on overtime, so I'm good. Oh, okay, gotcha. It was, it was hard for us all to get here at 830, but it's a wonderful thing. And thank you for what you do. Okay. Right, thank you. We love the Sheriff's Department here. And the, you don't always get to say that, but you guys put your money where your mouth is. Well, you give back. You, thank and, you for uh, that. We're, we're here to uh, take care of the public. You really are. You're one of the, uh, you know, I mean, I don't want to cap on anybody else, but y'all are the best Sheriff's Department I've ever dealt with. So thank you. Always nice seeing you, Ray. Okay, take, take care, care buddy. Thank yes, you. sir. And here's all our little team members out here cleaning in a group. I know, right? I know. Yes, ma'am. Thank you. Hey guys, this is Bob from HelpinDollar.org, and we're out here today at CO Beach for a cleanup for Sheriff Ramsey. And I just, while we're here in this beautiful beach, I just wanted to announce the next Sophie Caputo Award winner which was chosen by Sophie Caputo and her mom, which, and it's going to be Kaylee for all her extra efforts in cleaning the environment. We're so proud of you, and I'm going to try harder to clean the environment, and maybe I'll get the Sophie Caputo Award next. Congratulations. Kayla, we're actually proud of you because you're part of, you're one of the co-hosts for See My Beach for the Kids Zone also, and you as well, Kendall. And uh, it's always the same people who give back and all that stuff, and we appreciate it, okay? And yeah. Isabella's been doing this stuff for four years, and it's been wonderful four forever. Four years on the 27th. 27th, nice. 27th of this month? Yeah. That'll be our four-year anniversary with Isabella. Are we in June? We're in June, June. Then, yes. Yep, yep, okay, yep. Yeah, That's June. it. All right, and your birthday is this month also, huh? It's on Wednesday. Nice. Birthday happy birthday. Too. And when's Our your birthday? birthday too. Friday. Friday. Well, happy birthday, girls. All right, we'll have to do something for y'all when y'all get down and get out of school and everything. All right. We'll do a birthday party somewhere. How about that? All right. We got it. I know where. My where? where? You're on the, of this month too? Wow. Okay. How about we do one at uh, Boardwalk Pizza? Okay. All right. They'll have to do it now that I mentioned it on camera. Yeah. All right. So that's how we obligate people. <laughs> All right, guys. All right, that's it. It's a date. Yeah. All right, take care. Don't All hit right. me with the grabber. And we'll see everybody. No problem. Bye. Be good. Hi, Mom. Hey guys, it's Rick with See My Beach and Helping Dollar. What's up, everybody? Hey, how's it going? This is the people from All In Water Sports. Tell me your names for starting with you. I'm Angie. And? Jenny. Robert. Nice to meet you guys. I'm Rick with See My Beach, like I said. And we're glad to see you guys out here. And uh, met y'all at Chica. Always giving back to the community. You know what we tell people? If they give money to people like you who give back to the community, they take it from the ones who don't. And guess what? How, were, how would our world be if all the people who gave had all the money instead of a couple of dozen hoarding it all? 
So we are going to take money from those people and give it to the people who do good things, okay? So we want you to be some of those, okay? That's the philosophy of See My Beach and it's working. Anyway, you guys take care. Thanks for coming out. Anybody want to say anything? What kind of stuff are you finding today? All types of stuff from tennis bottle caps, plastic, tennis balls. <laughs> you name it, it's out here. We got to get it out. Put it where it belongs. Absolutely. Our mascot's the turtle. Oh, exactly. It's all about the turtle, it's all about the sea. One of my favorite videos was the, I did a video at the Turtle Hospital. It's amazing, you know, what they do to save those little guys. And they're, everything's in need. Our, the humans have screwed everything up. So we're all having, the good humans like us have to come out and try to fix it for the bad humans. So thank you for being good humans. The 21st century handshake. Thank you guys. All right, take care. We'll see y'all next time, okay? All right, see y'all later. CO speech. I really thought y'all were kidding at first. Y'all found this sign in here, huh? It's unbelievable. No parking between sign sign. Excellent. Oh, there's a return number on the back. Public oh, really? works side, La Mirada. And there was nobody parked. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, they'll get it now that y'all. They'll get it now that y'all pulled it out of the sand. All right, guys. Thank y'all for coming out to the cleanup. That's awesome. Thank you. And look, that would have been messing up the environment, but here it is. All right, Brian. Right. So, so, if, so if anyone's never seen, this is how they mount the signs, the highway signs, which you usually don't see because they're mounted. This one we found in the, or they found in the sand. Not at all. No OCD at all. It's coming out of there no matter how hard. That's right. Hey guys, it's Rick with SeeMyBeach.com and HelpingDollLitter.org and I'm out here today. We're at Sea Oats Beach, mile marker 75, and I'm here with these two young men. This one I know. Tell everybody who you are, Paul. Paul Kiever, Key Lime Sailing Club and Cottages, up at mile marker 99.3. Longtime supporter of Sea My Beach and now Helping Doll Litter. He actually sponsored last, uh, about two weeks ago, yeah. an event at uh, 90, 98 to 100 mile markers. Yeah. Supplied us all kinds of stuff for it. Thank you, Paul. All right. Tell everybody who you are, sir. I'm just meeting you for the first time. Yeah, my name is Robert Lockman. I'm a candidate for public defender. Lived in the Keys my whole life. Glad to help clean out the beaches. Been doing it my whole life. So. We like to see that, man. The keys come together, man. They don't. They don't play, man. Whenever, whenever I told Paul, you know, I actually sold you SeeMyBeach.com, yeah. and then just kind of haphazardly one day I'm in there talking about helping Dal Litter, and he's like, "Well, what, what is helping Dal Litter?" And I told him, he's like, "I got to be part of that." And I, little did I know, he already doesn't adopt a highway. So and every time we go out on the boat, we always pick up stuff and find stuff in the ocean anyway. So. I'm hearing more and more people say that. That's awesome, you know, because we got to clean up for the ones who come over here. We won't say from where and we won't say who and we won't say all those things. <laughs> but we all know they come over here and mess it all up. It takes all of us in the Keys to try to keep it nice. Yeah, we got it. Bro. Exactly. We're going to keep rolling. And I just finished leadership and our leadership project was to clean up cigarette butts. And we've made a big push. And, and That's awesome. It's going well and teaming up with Scenic Highway. We spoke. Well, we want to we yeah. team up with you on some stuff right. because, you know, we're, we're way into the, you know, higher fines for everything and cigarette butt fine. Key West just started a thing, $150 fine for... Actually, all the city stuff passed it, and now Monroe County actually passed it. They all got fines, and it's going well, and it's... Are you serious? That's awesome. Yeah, that is. Have you heard about Miami Beach, their fines? No. They're setting the example for everybody. No straws. Oh. I just heard a new, the new thing, no, uh, no sip well, straws. Oh, well, that's, that's good. I haven't even heard about that. But they say they're going to be the cleanest city in the, on, in the U.S., and they have a $1,500 minimum fine for cigarette butt or anything, up to $3,500. Wow. And they asked the guy, they said, well, so $3,500 is the highest fine? He said, well, beyond that, you get arrested. Wow. So they're not going to play. we got to do that because just, just talking about it ain't going to help. No, that's really good. You gotta, you gotta make it. You gotta make the fine big, and you gotta enforce the fine. Well, Without that, nothing else happens. And they, they've singled out cigarette butts because that's the, the the last accepted form of uh, littering. So. And also the stupidest thing a human can do. Yeah. Agreed. If you're listening to this and you smoke, <laughs> that's just Stop. stupid. <laughs> yeah, yeah. There's, there's so many other things you can do. Okay. You know, you're paying. The, you're financing your own death on the payment plan. You gotta pay for the, Not a smart the move. Okay. Tax, and if you throw it on the ground. Exactly. So, yeah, you're good right. to go. Exactly. Exactly. So win, win, win all the way. Thank you guys for coming together. All right. All right. Super nice meeting you okay good luck okay and we have almost everyone who's been on camera with see my beach is running for office as one all right it's, it's almost 100 like percent that. that's yeah. that's what we're we'll talking be about because we'll you know why because you know why you know why we meet people like you at places like this yeah. and we always say when you give like this that's the people we need in office so thank you my friend all right buddy see you later what's up and over here it's my brother john how you doing man and you you're starting to make it out of all the cleanups i appreciate that and this is paul's son 
It makes me super happy, man. These guys have a great relationship. And uh, you got corralled. He got corralled into the first one. And then I saw him today, and he's like, you know what? He said it's addictive, man. I got to be part of this stuff. <laughs> yeah, huh? you know, it's just it's so good for the environment. I'm so glad to be here. Uh, I don't think corralled is like, I think more like. That's what he said jokingly. <laughs> he's just like, Paul's just like, Paul's just like, guess what we're doing today? And it was, that was on the first cleanup. And since then, you're like, this is awesome. I want to I do the cleanups. So thank you guys for giving back and being part of what we do. It makes all the difference. Absolutely. Thank you, sir, my friend. You guys take care. Bye bye. Let me get it. Hey guys, this is Bob from Hope and Letter Oregon, where we just finished the cleanup at Sea Oats Beach. And I'm really happy because Paul and Johnny from Key Lime Sailing Club came. And a lot of my team members from a lot of my team members from Hope and All Litter came, uh, like Kendall and Kaylee, who are also my new co-hosts on KidsOnNotSamBeach.com, and all the families came, as well as uh, Miss Caputo and Miss Law from PKS and Key Largo School. We just had a lot of fun today. And we were at, we're doing this litter cleanup with who? With the sheriff's department. Absolutely, they always go in here for the community. And everybody, let's tell everybody what is going to change the world. All right. Help Help And here's some of the fine men who do this stuff. Thank you guys for what y'all do. You're always out here for the community and it means a lot to us. Thank you guys. Thank you. All right, see y'all later. All right, so we just finished the video as uh, cleaning up Sea Oats Beach. And we came to relax here at Jersey Boardwalk Pizza and they treated us to pizza. And as a bonus, they're going to be our sponsors for our next cleanup at Manatee Bay, which is going to be our biggest cleanup ever. And it's going to be a two-day cleanup. And I just want to thank them so much for sponsoring us. And one day is going to be dedicated to cleaning up the ocean, while the other is going to be dedicated to cleaning up the land. And I'm really excited for this cleanup. It's going to be great, and I just want to thank them so much for making it happen. It's our pleasure. Well, when I got in touch, this is Rick from HelpingDollar.org. When I got in touch with Jersey Boardwalk Pizza, they actually I was telling them our plans and how bad it was at Manatee Bay. And I was talking to Paul initially, then I met Joanne and everything, and they said they wanted to come together as a company. To, the franchise as well as the corporation and make this happen and make it happen good because it's, it's so important. So thank you guys to Jersey Boardwalk Pizza. Thank we love y'all. Thank you. We love your pizza even more. Yes. <laughs> That's that would you like the pizza Kaylee? How about you Isabel? Everybody was good? Alright. Thank y'all for coming. We had a good time. Thanks for supporting us. Manatee Bay coming up. We're gonna clean the world, right? Yeah. Helpin.litter.org. Helpin.litter.org. Bye everybody. Bye. What kind of what kind of wave is that? Princess wave. <laughs> okay. Right here at live at Boardwalk Pizza. Well, it won't be live when you're watching it, but it's live now. Boardwalk Pizza. Hello, everybody. Hi. I can see she loves my quips when I think I'm funny. She's back there like, what the heck's he talking about? It looks like you're really gonna walk home. <laughs> <laughs> I keep it. Now this is the hurting part. I got threatened by Kendall because I'm riding with Kendall and her mom. <laughs> because you know why we do that? Because even when we do this kind of stuff, we carpool because it saves energy. It impact. Fast. Today, for what we did, we saved two cars having to drive all the way to CO Beach. So that's what's important. Everything you do in life has to be part of making the world better. So these children right here will have a life. They got something going diabolical. Oh. <laughs> I still don't know what that is. It's a dance move. It's, it's goofy, that's what I say. Anyway, see y'all later. It's like the dust step or something. See y'all later. I'm not as cool as your parents. Go ask her. Go say that. Bye, y'all. Bye from Boardwalk Pizza.